Hello, uh, I just wanted to say that you guys did a really great job on your presentation today and I learned a bunch from you guys. Um, also, when it comes to the poverty simulation spent that we did today, the biggest thing that I got out of the simulation was how realistic it was. So every single decision that someone makes in their life affects their life in the future, whether it's positive or negative. Um, and I found it very eye-opening just how one small decision that you think is small can affect your life in such a major way. Um, and while watching the video regarding the connection between climate change, health, and poverty, um, I related somewhat to the video and what was said. So, um... I have asthma and when it's really cold or hot outside, even if I'm just walking, it really affects like my breathing. So sometimes I do have to use my inhaler, which I couldn't imagine, you know, being in a situation where I wasn't able to afford an inhaler or have insurance where I could get one. Um, and also too, with um, how the weather changes here in Michigan, I have really bad allergies, um, so now I have to take allergy medicine year-round, which I know that's not, like, something that has to be prescribed by a doctor, but just having the money to get inhalers or um, allergy medicine, like, I could not, I would be miserable without it, so I just, I couldn't imagine being in someone's shoes where they have conditions way worse than mine, but not able to afford like the basic me medications um and honestly I have never heard of the connection of all three before um but after watching the video it makes sense it really does um and just like the simulation that that video really opened my eyes to just what else is out there um and then also after listening to the presentation I believe generational poverty affects the community that I live in the most. Um, I live in Saginaw, so this also pertains to the area around Saginaw Valley. But um, I believe this is the biggest cause of poverty because being born in poverty, it is hard to break this cycle. And when all someone has known their entire life is poverty, it's hard to get out of that. So like if someone's grandparents grew up and then their parents, they don't have, you know, that role model or like they don't know how to break the cycle. So um, I th personally think that is um, our biggest issue here in Saginaw. Um, but other than that, you guys had a really great presentation and thank you so much.